during lockdown, when almost everything was at pause and we had time for ourselves, I had all these plans in my mind that I'm going to learn new things, now I'm going to read books, I'm going to learn how to cook and what. So, but all I did was watch movies all day and keep pushing those plans for next day. So while doing so, I had once in a while I had this guilt in me and that made me go up to the YouTube and watch some motivational videos, thinking that that could do some miracle for me, but instantly it did not. But while watching those videos, I had this word that catched my attention and it was discipline. So I googled up this word and the Google read the meaning, the process of taking actions or the process of making people follow code of behaviors or rules and using punishment to correct disobedience. That hit me, that, make, that reminded me of my school days. Do you remember those code of conducts that school had, uh, had set? Those rules and regulations we were obliged to follow. Dress tidy, be on time, keep your fingers on your mouth while walking. These were the rules. And do you remember the teachers punishing you for not obeying these rules? That gave me questions. What after school? Who sets these rules and who makes these code of behaviors? Who punishes you? And after all these guilds, I prepared myself, I pushed myself, and I read a few self-help books. Just like start with why, find, finish what you start. And that gave me my answer. It's you. It's you who sets those code of behaviors. It's you who set those rules for yourself. Self-discipline, it says. And self-discipline is what makes you enable the self-control in yourself despite all those distractions. And guess who gives you the punishment? It's life, my dear friends. Yes, it's life that gives you the punishment, the guilt, the regret, and all the opportunity missed. Those are the punishment that life throws at you if you are disobedient. So today I stand here practicing self-discipline and challenging myself to stand up despite all the self-doubts that I have within myself. My friends, we have one choice to make among these two pains, the pain of discipline and the pain of regret. And I choose the pain of discipline. What about you? Thank you, everyone. Hello, everyone. This is me, Shizana Tandukar. And for the Popular Choice Award, you can vote for me through Kalti app. Just go to the homepage and click on the voting app and search for Talking Titans 2. And you can search my ID, that's 1773. And you can vote for me. Please like and share my videos. Thank you, everyone. Have a good day.